I call the Honourable Member for Lindsay. Thank you, Madam Speaker. My question is to the Treasurer. Will the Treasurer outline to the House how the government is building jobs, growth and opportunity for the people of Western Sydney and all around Australia? I call the Honourable the Treasurer. Well, I thank the Honourable Member for Lindsay for a question, and I thank her for inviting me to her electorate recently, where we met with a range of business people who were very supportive of the construction of Badgerys Creek Airport yeah. and are absolutely determined to create more jobs and more opportunities uh, for uh, all the people of uh, Western Sydney, but those particularly in and around Badgerys Creek Airport, as a result of this government's commitment to get on with the job of constructing the airport, but also investing $2.8 billion in the roads around there up front and immediately. And this is what it's about. It's about creating jobs. Residential construction work done in the December quarter indicates residential construction activity in New South Wales was nearly 20 per cent higher over the 12 months to the end of last year. 20 per cent higher residential construction. And we went to a housing estate. We went to a housing estate, magnificent housing estate that has been built, as real evidence of the jobs are being created as we speak. Now, in 2014, <coughs> business investment in the services sector of our economy hit a record high of $62 billion, the strongest calendar year gain in seven years. And I might add, services represent around 70 per cent of our economy. So as the massive investment in mining infrastructure and, and new resources projects comes off, as was expected under the previous government, as is expected under us, we've got to fire up the rest of the economy, particularly in services, and now we've got record levels of investment in services. That means we've got record opportunities to grow the economy. And you know what the best thing we can do? For the services sector is, it is to Holton. build new markets. Yeah, is yeah. to build new markets because whilst it represents around 70% of the Australian economy, it represents around 20% of our exports. So if we could lift services in healthcare, in education, in IT, in a range of different fields, if we can lift those services exports to be the same part, the same ratio as it is in relation to uh, the Australian economy. We are going to see billions of dollars flood into the Australian economy and tens of thousands of new jobs. And that comes about because we expand the market. We've already got the strong base in the services sector. Now we have to expand the market, getting into aged care services into China, getting into health and education services in Korea, getting into a range of different services exports in Japan. This is what we are delivering now, and it will end up in delivering more jobs for Australians and greater prosperity. Yeah. I